10 things to know about brushing your teeth. Brushing your teeth right away after eating is risky. Brushing your brushing your teeth shortly after eating can harm your tooth enamel, the outer coating of your tooth. Acidic meals like meat, pasta, and fish erode the tooth enamel. Following a meal, dentists advise waiting at least 30 minutes before brushing your teeth. Your tooth enamel will have ample time to solidify once more and protect itself from injury. The toothbrush we use today was invented in prison. It's absurd to imagine a time before the invention of the toothbrush. The most typical method of cleaning teeth in the past was to use a rug and soot. In 1780, when he was in jail for inciting a disturbance, William Addis, who detested this method of brushing his teeth, invented the first toothbrush. By drilling holes into a cabone and inserting pig hairs, he created it. He established a business to produce his innovation in large quantities as soon as he was freed from prison. When you rinse, there is no point in brushing. After brushing your teeth, you rinse to remove fluoride, an active component of toothpaste. Your teeth are more vulnerable to oral health issues like tooth decay, gum disease, and acid erosion after being extracted. Fluoride can still be removed by mouthwash even after brushing your teeth. The only way to spit out excess toothpaste without losing the fluoride is to spit it out. The only time you should rinse with water is after flossing, as this ensures that any food particles still in your mouth are removed. Your teeth will suffer from using a toothbrush with rough bristles. Because some consumers still think they are more effective at cleaning their teeth, some hard bristle toothbrushes are still available. The idea that a hard bristle toothbrush cleans teeth more effectively is a misconception, though. Dentists do not advise it since it might cause your gums to bleed and harm your tooth enamel. They advise using a soft bristle toothbrush instead since it gently eliminates plaque from your teeth and gums. Additionally, it can clean teeth in places a hard bristle toothbrush can't. But keep in mind that using a hard bristle toothbrush is still preferable than vigorously brushing with a soft bristled one. Bad breath cannot be eliminated by simply brushing your teeth. No matter how frequently you brush your teeth each day, if you don't clean your tongue, you'll still have terrible breath. You should clean your tongue if you notice that it is turning white or yellow. Bacteria build up on the tongue causes it to become white or yellow, and with time, this bacteria can spread to your teeth and gums. Because of this, brushing your teeth will no longer effectively shield them from oral health issues. You can clean your tongue with the back of your toothbrush, but a tongue scraper works better at removing bacteria and avoiding foul breath. Your teeth could get damaged by whitening toothpaste. More abrasive chemicals are found in whitening toothpaste than in conventional toothpaste. By removing extrinsic stains or stains from the top layer of your teeth, this might give the appearance that your teeth are a little bit whiter. Coffee, cigarette, and soda stains are a few examples. However, using whitening toothpaste carries a risk because it thins the enamel, making your teeth sensitive and possibly making them look darker. You have bacteria on your toothbrush. After cleaning your teeth, bacteria from your mouth remain on your toothbrush. While the majority of the bacteria are unharmful, some can nevertheless lead to diseases. Despite cleaning your toothbrush with water, studies have shown that some bacteria can still be discovered there. For this reason, dentists advise changing your toothbrush frequently. Because a fresh toothbrush is less likely to support bacterial and fungal growth in addition to successfully eliminating plaque. Additionally, it's best to avoid storing your toothbrush in a closed container, because doing so creates moisture, which germs love. Poor dental hygiene can contribute to heart problems. You wouldn't think dental issues, 
or poor oral hygiene might lead to cardiac issues. However, a study discovered that those who had gum disease and poor dental hygiene were more likely to develop coronary heart disease. Bacterial infection brought on by bleeding gums can enter the circulation and harm several body components, including the heart. This tooth issue has the potential to cause heart valve infection and vascular irritation. Maintaining good oral hygiene will help you have teeth and a heart that are healthy. Brushing your teeth without toothpaste is acceptable. Unexpectedly, toothbrushes are sufficient to clean your teeth. Simply using them to wash your teeth can remove plaque. Even dentists recommend dry brushing because it forces you to wash your teeth more thoroughly and removes more plaque. Whether you use toothpaste or not, you should aim to clean your teeth for two minutes. You won't be able to thoroughly clean your teeth of plaque if you only brush for a few seconds. On the other hand, brushing for longer than two minutes might lead to tooth erosion or gum recession. Compared to a manual toothbrush, an electric toothbrush cleans better. Due to its vibration or rotational component, an electric toothbrush is more successful in removing plaque. Additionally, it does a better job of promoting gum health. There is a significant difference in the amount of movement each minute. Depending on the type of electric toothbrush you use, an electric toothbrush can create up to 48,000 movements per minute, compared to a manual toothbrush's 300 to 400 motions per minute. The built-in timer on the majority of electric toothbrushes ensures that you always brush your teeth for at least two minutes, which makes them even better.